think it is? What do I think it is? <laughs> well, it's like an air sculpture. It's beautiful. It's soaring, and it's almost like a roller coaster ride when you look at it, isn't yeah. it? It's beautiful. Yeah. Very beautiful. My name is Gina Siepel and uh, I am an artist and a sculptor, video artist, I make drawing, I do performance events um, and this piece is at the APE Gallery in Northampton, um, it's called One by One and it is a one inch wide by one mile long piece of wood. I've made several boats in my work, I do a lot of woodworking, I have a long history as a woodworker and um, fabricator of all different types of things. I do theater work, I build sets. Um, and I, in building boats, I began to get more and more interested in the potential of wood, working with wood in, in curved dimensions. Um, there's something just inherently fascinating about scale and about shifts in scale, and we all know what it feels like to walk a mile. And the idea that you could compress that distance into an interior space is really interesting to me and I think there's something that just makes you think differently about both what a mile is and what um, an interior space is. Um, also, I'm really interested in, you know, just the idea of just um, making this line out of something that we normally think of as a fixed, stable thing mm -hmm. and activating this architectural space. We're used to relating to a room like this in a certain way um, and this line makes us kind of negotiate the space in a totally new way. Do you think the whole mile is going to fit in? Just trying to get a whole mile of that wood in there. Oh, wow. Oh, I don't see really like to know how much well, we can currently, estimate. Yeah. How long is the mile? So you think she can do it's it? A, it's yes. A, it's a packing problem. Definitely. That's an excellent idea. <laughs> this is truly just a physics problem. <laughs> you think the whole mile will fit? I'm really not sure at this point. I think that, you know, given the size of the space itself, um, I've sort of planned to stop at the point at which it feels like the piece might sort of break itself through the weight, um, or if I really just can't move in it anymore. I mean, we're a little bit over a quarter mile at this point, so it's, um, it's pretty full already. Um, so, but actually I think in a way getting to a mile is less the objective for me than, um, than making an interesting kind of three-dimensional drawing that really does activate this space in a new way. Mm -hmm. The piece is also going to be lit by a lighting designer, Kathy Couch. Kathy uh, is going to light it with the idea of drawing in mind, so she's going to utilize the potential for making shadows on these white walls. Um, and all kinds of, you know, you'll be able to see it at night through the storefront windows. Um, so she's going to begin lighting it next week as it's still being built. So the lighting design is also going to be kind of part of the emergent kind of improvisational um, approach. Mm -hmm. 